Hey guys, it's me, Crescent Wolf here. Um, I'm going to be showing a really random hiding location <laughs> in this game. But it can be one that can be accessed. But only if this gate and... Um, only if that gate and this door is open. Only if those two. Those are the requirements. Well, I'm going to show you uh, the way to get to there as a host. Because you are required to kill something. Otherwise, that something will knock you out of your hiding spot. So you got to be careful of this. a place with a really great view but it's kind of awkward uh, crap I gotta deal with these guys again this is actually second attempt here because first attempt my game glitched and like uh, sent me out of my game so that's unfortunate, but I have to make a second attempt. But, yeah. Let's get on with this. It's going to be somewhere near here. But I know for a fact it's around here because this is the only enemy inside of this building of its kind. send you falling off from over here like literally if you peek out from around the corner on this particular ledge right over here where that message is which is where we're going to be hiding uh, she will come running around this corner and smack you with her mace through the wall which is bullshit but yeah enemies have bullshit mechanics in this game and again, weapons have bullshit mechanics in this game too. And also, I would recommend bringing the silver cat ring for this as well, because it just makes it that much more useful for this area. Because there are a lot of high heights here. Yeah, now we're going to be going up the elevator this time. Now since we got the old lady out of the way. Now I just have to uh, survive the rest of the way to the location. Where I drop um, down onto the platform. But what we're going to be heading to is the rail on the platform. So we need to be wary of the... Uh, because those guys are going to be a pain. That and the... Here are the enemies on the way there, including the thralls.
want to deal with thralls on the other side. Because they're going to be a pain too. Oh, come here. I'll take you. Oh no. Not this again. Cathedral Knight with an Ultra Great Sword over there, that's gonna be a pain. And then there's this one, which was I'm gonna try to remove first. Because it's easier to fight them over here. Definitely not gonna like this next part. Because this next part's gonna hurt a lot. If I mess this up, because I think you'll hide at the moment. So there's a platform I can drop down to, which doesn't make it difficult. Still another knight I have to deal with, and he's gonna be a pain because not only does he have a crossbow, but he also has a mace, which is gonna make him a pain to deal with. And already he's shooting at us. happen sometimes. And again, nothing dropped from them. Oh well. Um, anyways, we're getting to the part which uh, we will be... Why is there a blood stain inside of the slab? That makes no sense. Anyways, um, it's not that one, but that's another tricky hiding spot. But that can be done with um, three summons and just have them on that platform. And then the host pulls that up and that works that way. But I'm talking about right here, which of course is a bit tricky because then you have to land on this particular ledge. And only two people can fit. There we go. I got lucky there. That could have went wrong. But yeah, this is where everything's a lot easier now. Now all you need to do is land here and there. That's how you get here as a host, which of course requires some work. And thankfully, before anyone hits you over here, including that old lady, you can literally just jump right off onto the ground safely if you have a cat ring. And it's completely survivable at this height. So yes, they have um, thought it through carefully about these locations and where to fall. But yeah, my message right here is, could this be a safe zone, but be wary of jumping off. <laughs> uh, but yeah, 
that's it for this uh, thing. Hope you all enjoyed. Have fun trolling.